Hey guys, it's Travis with GE Landscape Supply. Today we're going to take you out in the yard and show you all the different types of soils and compost that we offer here at GE. We're going to tell you the differences between them and how they're best used in your landscaping. The first type of soil we're going to look at today is topsoil. This is good black dirt in its native state. There are no rocks or sticks in it. If it rains though, this soil may get some lumps or clumps in it. This soil is best around foundations, filling holes, and building berms. You can use it in several other applications like planter boxes and gardens. Regular topsoil is a little more difficult to work with than pulverized soil, which is the next soil we're going to look at. This is our pulverized topsoil. As you can see, it's a lot looser than regular topsoil. To get the soil like this, we take our regular topsoil and run it through our pulverizer. This machine has a series of hammers which break the soil down, making it really easy to work with. Pulverized topsoil is great for top dressing your lawn when overseeding, putting in planter boxes, flower gardens, and leveling out areas around your home. This is our potting soil mix. It's a 50-50 blend of organic compost and pulverized topsoil. This mix works best for overseeding your lawn and improving the soil in your garden. With this mix, you'll use less fertilizer because it's more nutrient enriched. This mix is also great for outdoor containers and even indoor house plants. This is the same stuff you can buy in bags in the big box stores, except this is a lot less expensive. Also, you can see it's much easier to work with than the bag soil because the bags sit in pallets and get compressed into almost clay-like consistencies, making it very difficult to work with. Here's our organic compost. It's made primarily with yard waste, mostly leaves, grass clippings, and so forth. Our organic compost is aged six to nine months, and it breaks down into a pulverized soil consistency. This mix is outstanding when you're trying to amend a poor quality soil. It also works well in vegetable gardens, flower gardens, and landscape beds, as well as any place you just want to improve your soil quality. This is our manure compost. This compost is made of manure we get from a cattle feed lot in Milford. Like our organic compost, it's also aged six to nine months, breaking it down into a pulverized soil consistency. And at this age, there's no stench. Manure compost is more like fertilizer, so you don't want to use very much of it because you can burn whatever you're trying to enrich. The last type of soil we're going to look at is clay. As you can see, this is clay in its natural form, and it works best for going around foundations because it naturally repels water. It also works well for building up a small mound if you're trying to create a waterfall for a backyard water feature. All of our soils can be purchased in any quantity, from 5-gallon buckets to 14-yard dump trucks. Several of our clients even bring their pots and planters in the trunk of their car. Whatever works easiest for you, we'll help you get it filled. Thanks for watching, and for more help and information on landscaping, you can stop in and talk to one of our experts, or call us. You can follow us on Facebook and Twitter, or check out the blog on our website at gelandscapesupply.com for more tips and tricks.